Hey guys, in my last video, I used a call sign and I think I ripped a hole in the universe. The comments were, uh, and the questions, even emails that I got were, um, were pretty incredible. I think I took for granted that everyone knew what I was doing, but, um, obviously they didn't. And this is the, uh, this is the call sign I was using. It's Kilo for Oscar Golf Oscar Stroke Whiskey One calling CQ, CQ Poda. So there you go. Kilo for Oscar Golf Oscar Stroke Whiskey One. What I'm trying to do here is to show that I'm not at home. I'm in um, I'm in Rhode Island, and uh, so naturally I'm a four call. Four is from Virginia to Florida. The Southeast is is traditionally, and we get a new call. You're a four call. That's your area. One is New England. One is Connecticut, Rhode Island, Massachusetts, um, Vermont, New Hampshire, and Maine. So uh, the New England is the one calls. Um, I did not have to use the whiskey. I got a lot of that. Yeah, I know that. Um, I I used one. I didn't have to use anything. That's the really the thing. Um, I, I actually got um, some uh, some emails and some comments from uh, typical you know the drive by uh, experts, and um, and they were telling me you don't have to use that. You don't have to do that. I know that. Let me tell you why I did it. I don't know if I'm going to continue to do it, but why I did it. I have a lot of logs in QRZ. I log with QRZ. I have my K4 OGO. I have my SP stroke K4 OGO, which I used in Europe. And there's a, an example where you have to use a prefix under the CEPT agreement when I'm operating in another country. Um, th there, there you go. Um, I have my K4 OGO stroke KH6 log, when I'm in Hawaii, I use that. And then now I put up the, the Whiskey One log, and I did it for a reason. Not so much for me, but a lot of people want to put Rhode Island. They need that state. It's a small state. It's a small state in the country. And I, I just figured that I could be true to logging with that and have a separate log from my regular K4 OGO log and um, and do it. And, and that way, um, when you would log me or I would log somebody in um, QRZ under the whiskey one, I would, um, you know, it would be perfect. I also, a lot of times I'll do these videos. If you see, you'll, you'll see, I'll put the kilometers and the miles, the distance of the contact in my, um, whiskey one, I use the grid square and the location that I'm at, and I'm going to be at here for a while in Rhode Island. So it'll be a true log and I can just keep up with it. So I did it for me. No, I don't have to do it in the United States. Now, especially you can get a vanity call with any number you want. It's not required. I know that. I understand that. I don't need any more any more emails or comments telling me that I'm doing it all wrong or I, I don't have to do it or whatever. I know that. I was doing it out of courtesy to other people, and you know, so they could get Rhode Island in their in their logbook. And I was doing it for me so I could keep up with it. You know, using the whiskey, it was just something I thought it sounded better than just a stroke one. You know, and and a lot of times, like if you come over from the UK, you have to use whiskey or kilo, whatever number you're in. And um, I thought that would be pretty cool. I know if I was in Canada, I would be. Um, it would be actually a, a, a suffix um, denominator as well. Let's just say I was up in uh, Nova Scotia. It would be um, K4 OGO stroke. Victor Edward one VA V one and then I I have to also would have to mention my QTH and my contacts as well. I'm uh, twenty kilometers north of Halifax or whatever. So um, there's a lot of rules and a lot of laws in that. No, there's no requirement, no rule in the states to do that. Just thought it would be a good thing to do. I know you know you in in the states you can put anything with a stroke, a slash, a slant, whatever you want to call it behind it. People go stroke portable, slash portable. Slant portable, slant mobile, and, and the one that causes another stare, slant QRP. I know when I was in Hawaii, I took advantage of everything I can when I was sitting there with five watts on the beach and uh, trying to make contacts. CQ, 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 Kilo 4, Oscar, Golf, Oscar, slash KH6, portable QRP in Hawaii, calling CQ, CQ, anyone, anyone. Kilo 4, Oscar, Golf, Oscar, slash KH6, calling CQ, CQ, portable QRP. So there you go. Actually, um, I had a QSO with a guy in uh, New Zealand, which was a long way. He said, I, I, when I heard QRP, that's why I came back to you. So, um, you know, using those... Uh, that little extra after the stroke, after your call, that's up to you as an American ham. It's not a, it's not a requirement. I don't know if I'm going to do it anymore. I, I thought about it after I did it. I was like, wow, so many people. I just took for granted that people would understand what I was doing. They don't. 
Um, I, and I know, I tell you what, it's, it, it, it actually can be a pain in the butt too. You have to repeat yourself a lot. I know when I was in Poland where I was required to use the, uh, the, the SP stroke at the beginning of it, man, it, no one ever got it right. Sierra Papa stroke kilo four Oscar golf Oscar. Yeah, it's a struggle. When I was uh, there, it, it seemed, I think over a course of time, over two years or so, going back and forth, thousands of QSOs, maybe three or four times, someone actually got it on the first try. It was a long Sierra Papa stroke kilo for Oscar Golf Oscar. And the language and stuff, it was tough. So that's why I think also here, I'm going to be here for a, quite a while. I don't know if I'm really going to use the... Uh, the stroke whiskey one all the time. I'm going to keep the log. What I'll probably do is, um, you know, I really want to be fair to people. You know, people also may not have Virginia and they talk to me in Rhode Island and then they're going to log me. I know I could go back and change it, but I'm going to be going home a lot, you know, weekend. So I'm going to, it was just going to be a pain in the butt to keep going in and changing my grid square every time. I really wanted to keep something separate. What I may do is log, um, just call K4OGO, log in my whiskey one, and then if people need a verification, I'll send them back over. Or if you work me, in, and I say I'm in Rhode Island, and you work me as K4OGO, um, drop me a line or whatever, and I'll log you in, and we can we can verify the log through the uh, one through the whiskey one. And like I said, I I could probably just go K4OGO stroke one and, and do it that way as well, but. I don't know. It's something that, you know, I just got here. I'm going to be here for a long time. It's something I wanted to do because I have so, the log. I did it in Hawaii. I did it in Poland and I did it here. You don't have to do it. Um, and like I said, I could not believe, uh, I guess I'm just naive thinking everybody understood this. I kind of remember it being a question on the tech or maybe the general years ago. Um, I, I thought everyone knew whether, you know, when you add a, a, you know, something at the end, I know people do it for field day and, and, and a lot of, you know, portable or whatever they do that. But um, yeah, I just kind of took for granted that people knew. And, and I'm, you know, if you didn't, and hopefully you can learn now, you'll understand why I was doing it. Um, but um, yeah, anything you do different, it seems to generate some pretty interesting comments and emails from people. And um, I understand, you know, I, you know, we're all learning and, uh, and it's a learning experience. But anyway, um, there you go. Just kind of wanted to explain it, what I was doing. I, I got so many questions and comments and I even, like I said, even emails. I said, you know what, I'm just going to do a video and explain myself. And, um, and that's why I did it and, uh, and what I was doing. Anyway, um, I'm going to uh, get off my soapbox now, and I hope that kind of clears it up for some people. Um, if you hear me out there and uh, you want to know where I'm at, go, hey, Walt, where's your QTH? And I'll tell you, and then we can log it however you want to. Probably just going to go back to K4OGO. That's all I need to do while I'm here. I'm in the States. I'm, you know, I'm totally legal. And just do it that way. Well, um, I don't complain a lot, but I do, you know, every once in a while I have my little rants. This was obviously a rant somewhat. Um, if you really like uh, portable ham radio and operating portable and, uh, and the adventures of me operating by the sea, and, um, and like I said, I'm in Rhode Island now, which is the ocean state, um, please like and subscribe. And, um, and I got some pretty cool stuff coming up. And uh, as a matter of fact, I'm getting ready to go uh, play a little radio right now. So um, a couple days after this video, you'll see what I'm about to do. Until next time, I'm Walt, K4OGO, Stroke Whiskey 1, <laughs> 73, my friends.